back in the dirty shop today with a, uh, another semi-pro drill press tip. This is something I use a lot for drilling conduit uh, and uh, different pipes, but mostly conduit. I build a lot of things out of conduit. It's cheap. You can get it anywhere. It's galvanized so it doesn't rust. You don't have to paint it. Uh, so generally speaking, it's pretty good. It's got good structure to it too. If you don't want to use a piece of wood, conduit works great. So what I want a lot of the time is for my holes to line up in the pipe so that the two holes or three holes or whatever I've drilled in this thing all line up. And in order to do that, it's really hard to get on here and drill them out by hand, just by eyeball. You'll never get them straight. And then sometimes I want those holes to be 90 degrees off of them. So I'll have a hole here or 90 degrees off here. And I'm going to show you a quick way to do that. So obviously I've drilled this pipe already using my technique, but you're going to go over to your drill press. You're going to mark out and drill your first hole fairly carefully so that it's nice and clean through your pipe, nice and straight. Then you're going to get yourself bored. A two by four, you can make this first, obviously. I used just a little piece of two by four here. I put a bolt through it from the back, just drilled a hole in it and threaded a bolt in so it sticks up. Now my conduit, the first hole that I've drilled, goes right onto that bolt, right there. This bolt's just like the very limit of the right length. You want it to go through both sides. And now, when I put this up here, no matter where it moves to, I could drill it straight. So now I could come through, drill my second hole, and it will be straight lined up with the other one. If you want to drill 90 degrees off of this, you're going to take a tape measure, and you're going to measure the distance here, right by the bolt. Okay? And then you're going to go over to your table saw, and you're going to cut out a piece of wood that fits in this gap exactly. All right? This one has, I don't have one right now, but this is a representation. Now, when you, when you drill it, you're going to put that chunk of wood right under there. You're going to hold the whole thing together, and now you can drill it, and you'll have a, a hole that's 90 degrees off of your first one. I hope this helps some of you guys out for your projects. I use it all the time. When I figured this out the first time, I was just thrilled, and I used it a lot. So uh, I hope you enjoy. Thanks for watching.